it's been quite nice. It's been a little bit different to normal years where it's just constant game after game after game. It's been nice to have a bit of a, a refocus. You know, we we played Amptill, then we had a bit of a refocus there, able to then go into Hartbury. So it was nice. It's just been a bit of a change, especially for for myself and probably the older guys that have done quite a lot of seasons now. It's it's something different and a little bit more. I don't really know the word really. It's not relaxing, but it's, it just kind of gives you that kind of reboot every time. If that if we've got if we've got injuries in the squad, we can kind of get them up to hopefully back for the following games and stuff. But um, yeah, it's been nice for me personally. I've quite enjoyed it. The last two weeks have been really pleasing in terms of just being able to kick on for that 480. We're still not 100 percent there yet. We're still letting teams off slightly, but we're building now and. Obviously, had Ross come in at the beginning of the year at quite late notice when Anthony Allen went. So, just getting our attack, I feel our attack is starting to to get to where we want it to be. Um, and the same with the defence. Gaysbrook came in and he's got a different defence philosophy to what Anthony Allen had last year when he was looking after us. So, I think it's all coming together now quite nicely. Is it a real shame in that regard then that there's only what four games left of the season? Yeah, it is. It is. Um, Body might say no, but um, <laughs> but in terms of uh, yeah, just just the feel around the squad and stuff like that. I think we're just really enjoying our rugby at the moment. And um, don't get me wrong, we've got three really tough games coming up, real championship games, and obviously the last one against or well, the last of the three against Saracens is um, it's big three games. So we kind of know that we've got a we've got a lot of work to go before the end of the season. Koff have got men over on the right. They're playing from the 22. Here comes Forsyth. Got Fenner outside him. Great time on the pass. Fenner finds Butt inside. Here oh. comes Josh Barton, and it's an end-to-end -end score from Coventry. Brilliant. That's the bonus point. There's seven and a half minutes to play, and like just like that, from a hit and a turnover deep in their 22, Koff have gone. 70 metres for one of the scores of the season. You say how good the team can be. I think, you know, the bonus point try, you know, Josh Barton's try against Ampsill and then Sam Lewis's first try against oh, Hartbury. Here, you know, that just goes to show, as you say, just ha four, what rugby this team, is, this group is capable of. Yeah, we've got some real talent, to be honest. Um, you know, we've got guys that have played a lot of rugby, but then we've got some guys that are, are young and really, really exciting to, you know, I'm lucky enough to keep them guys here for long term. I can see some of them playing hundreds of games for Cobb, you know, um, and being a big stake uh, stay foot in the in the team. But um, it just shows, mate. Once we get on that front foot, and once we we keep ball in hand, exactly how we want to put, attack. Basically, we're we're very very dangerous. We've just now got to start learning from them. Little probably mental switch offs would be the best word for it. From your own personal perspective how good is it to be getting a run of games and not just a run of games but a run of games in the same position each week yeah it's massive like last year was probably the toughest year i've had as a rugby player in terms of injuries it wasn't just one injury it was an injury after injury and it just in the end it got to the point where is this really what is it worth doing anymore and it was you know i had some tough conversations with roland and you know and i think in terms of the lockdown coming and the season can it stopping, it, it probably was a benefit for me personally, maybe not for the team, but for me, it, it enabled me to, to get my body right again um, and to start training, you know, away from the club. I've been at the club for a long time, which I just gave me a reset and, and it made me realise very, very quickly how much I love playing for this club and how much, rugby is a part of my life and I, and I really really wanted to come back and make a thing but I really didn't know how my body was going to react so the minute I got got some miles in my legs again away from the club and then was able to kind of string them together when I came back for pre-season it was it was a breath of fresh air you know and um, I actually picked up a concussion around Christmas time in a training instant and it was like oh here we go again kind of thing but was able to shrug that off and obviously still having time before the game started and, and then got into pre-season. So it's just, it, for me personally, it's nice to just be out there playing. And I can, I can feel while I'm out there that I appreciate it much more than I did. And that's why I'm enjoying it.